Prostate cancer is a type of cancer that develops in the prostate gland, which is a small gland located below the bladder in men. It occurs when the cells in the prostate gland start to grow and divide uncontrollably, forming a tumor. Symptoms of prostate cancer can vary depending on the stage and severity of the disease. In its early stages, prostate cancer may not cause any noticeable symptoms. However, as the cancer progresses, symptoms can include 1. Frequent urination, especially at night. 2. Difficulty starting or stopping urination. 3. Weak or interrupted urine flow. 4. Blood in urine or semen. 5. Pain or discomfort in the pelvic area. 6. Erectile dysfunction. 7. Bone pain, especially in the spine, hips, or ribs, if the cancer spreads to the bones. It's important to note that these symptoms can also be caused by other non-cancerous conditions, such as benign prostatic hyperplasia, BPH, which is the enlargement of the prostate gland. BPH is a common condition in older men and is not linked to cancer. However, BPH can cause similar urinary symptoms and may require treatment. For the treatment of an enlarged prostate, there are several options available. The treatment approach will depend on the severity of symptoms and their impact on a person's quality of life. The common treatment options include 1. Watchful waiting. If the symptoms are mild or not bothersome, a doctor may choose to closely monitor the condition without initiating treatment immediately. Medications. Certain medications, such as alpha blockers, e.g., tamsulosin, terazosin, and 5-alpha reductase inhibitors, e.g., finasteride, didasteride, can be prescribed to help relax the muscles around the prostate and reduce its size. These medications can help alleviate urinary symptoms. 3. Minimally invasive procedures. Various procedures can be performed to reduce the size of the prostate or improve urinary flow. Examples include transurethral resection of the prostate, TURP, transurethral incision of the prostate, TUIP, and laser therapy. 4. Surgery. In severe cases or when other treatments are ineffective, surgery may be recommended. The most common surgical option for an enlarged prostate is a transurethral resection of the prostate, TURP. It's important to consult with a healthcare professional who can assess the specific situation and provide appropriate guidance on the best treatment option. The treatment of prostate cancer depends on various factors such as the stage of the cancer, the age and overall health of the individual, and the specific characteristics of the tumor. Medications can play a significant role in the treatment of prostate cancer, both as part of initial therapy and for advanced stages of the disease. Here are some common medications used in the treatment of prostate cancer. 1. Hormone therapy. Prostate cancer often relies on male hormones, primarily testosterone, for growth. Hormone therapy aims to reduce the production or block the action of these hormones, slowing down the growth of cancer cells. Examples of hormone therapy drugs include luprolide, luprin, gozerlin, zolicard, and bicalutamide. Casadex. 2. Chemotherapy. Chemotherapy drugs kill cancer cells or prevent their growth. These medications are typically used in advanced cases of prostate cancer when hormone therapy is no longer effective. Dostaxel, Taxotere, and Cabazitaxel, Jevtana, are commonly used chemotherapy drugs for prostate cancer. 3. Targeted therapy. Targeted therapy drugs are designed to specifically target cancer cells, limiting damage to healthy cells in the body. Abiraterone, Zitiga, and Enzalutamide, Standy, are examples of targeted therapy drugs used in advanced prostate cancer. 4. Immunotherapy. Immunotherapy drugs stimulate the body's immune system to fight cancer cells. Cipusol T. Provenge is an immunotherapy drug approved for advanced prostate cancer. 5. Bone strengthening medications. Prostate cancer can spread to the bones, leading to bone pain and fractures. Medications like zoledronic acid, Zomita, and Dinosumab, Sjiva, 
are used to strengthen the bones and reduce the risk of fractures. It's important to note that the specific treatment plan and medications use will be determined by a healthcare professional based on the individual specific circumstances and needs. Certainly. Here are a few more medications and treatment options used for prostate. Certainly. Here are a few more medications and treatment options used for prostate cancer. 6. Radiation therapy. Radiation therapy uses high-energy x-rays or other types of radiation to destroy cancer cells or prevent them from growing and dividing. It can be used as a primary treatment or in combination with other therapies. There are different types of radiation therapy, including external beam radiation and brachytherapy, which involves placing radioactive seeds directly into the prostate gland. 7. Prostate-specific membrane antigen, PSMA, inhibitors. PSMA inhibitors are a newer class of medications that target the PSMA protein that is found on the surface of prostate cancer cells. These inhibitors can help deliver radiation therapy more effectively to cancer cells. Lutetium Lu-177 PSMA, 617, Lu PSMA, is one such PSMA inhibitor used in the treatment of advanced prostate cancer. 8. Androgen receptor inhibitors. Androgen receptor inhibitors, such as apalutamide, erlita, and darolutamide, nabica, work by blocking the action of androgens, male hormones, from interacting with the androgen receptor. These drugs are used for non-metastatic castration-resistant prostate cancer, where the cancer has progressed despite hormone therapy but hasn't spread to other parts of the body. 9. Palliative care. In advanced cases of prostate cancer, where the cancer has spread to other parts of the body, palliative care becomes an essential component.